Good morning. We, day two, Rome. We are leaving our hotel. We are going to head and get some breakfast. And then we're meeting our tour guide for the day at 8.30 and we're going to do the Coliseum and Vatican. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah, this is okay. So I was watching a video on this. It's the two churches, and they were built to be symmetrical. So this whole plaza is symmetrical. But it's two individual churches. This one's a challenging one. It gets even better. Animals, exotic birds inside. Those were aviaries. Parrots, we didn't have them. And they were put here for the first time. That's cool. Now, do you see them? A lot of them. It's like a lot of blue orange. Of 
So the floors, the black and white floors. Before the construction of the Colosseum. Everything down below, the lifestyle is the woman's home. And you see the building with the bath tower at the end? That's not the form anymore. That's another small field. It's for the capital and field. And it's uh, where we have the office of the mayor. That building right there. Our mayor still to this day. The seat is right there. So that's where we were, and now we're down in the forum. Caper. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one has no caper. Now. I, I'm sure there are other plants here. The, the Roman form is actually full of caper. They grow, they, they like concrete. They usually grow in the oven. It's kind of a little citrusy. You, I put them on like pizza oh, before salads. Yes. Close. Oh, these two are one year apart. Okay. Yeah. They just look a lot alike. <laughs> you and Landon. It doesn't look great. You see only the bricks, but you have to imagine it was covered by a white marble facade that it was removed. Uh, all the temples, also the Colosseum, they were pillaged. That's what happened. That's why we don't have a lot of marble left in our church. So when they, was, when they started to use uh, that place as a Christian temple, they just left the door the way it was. Nobody touched that. The rest of the metals will be melted down to build weapons started to have temples where people could go inside just okay. like nowadays in the churches but not at the beginning yeah it's like only the priest had the <laughs> he would not eat Winnie <laughs> Julius Caesar was cremated. Everybody gathered here in front of the tomb uh, and the cremation process and they started to cry because he was very popular I mean, especially lower class, yeah. class people. Nobody was happy about the killing. Right. Just the senators that did that. that yeah. yeah. Wow, that's awesome. Here. Yes. And the ladies that were about to get married they would make sacrifices on the other side to the to the goddess in the hope of finding a very nice couple. At the Colosseum. You what? Like the water stool that you 
Imagine that's the place where the gladiators will fight on the top of the arena. Huh? It used to be though entirely covered. That town of Statue over there, you will not see them in the on the time of the Romans. All this arena will go to the other side where those people are standing. Covered. And the town of Statue down down below is the underground. It's like the backstage. You keep all the things that eventually will be brought on the level of the arena. It's quite large, huh? You know the capacity of the Colosseum? Guess how many people can actually fit here? Yeah, around 70,000. It's like a modern stadium. Yeah, around 70,000. More, more. Okay. Oh, that's a nice place. Yeah, this. You know, guys, if you were very wealthy and very powerful in Rome, you would sit in the first row, very close to the arena, all together with the end. Yeah, I see what seats. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Seats, for example. They have the names of the senator that used to sit over there. Yeah. For VIP. In the middle section, you have the middle class, and up above, you have those that didn't have any right. People that even have the, the green cards on the top, oh, oh, they will stay up. You know, from the top, you don't hear a lot. It's the view from the Coliseum. You see all the way underground. You know, also what? You, know, you don't have to imagine that the entire floor of the Arena Bolivia only by a couple. You actually have several rooms to fill the Oh yeah, and all the different tours. <laughs> That's all the stickers. That's cool. It's all the different people have been on tours. Yeah, of the large mm. groups. Yeah. Yourself. Right. Okay. Yeah. That's what the, a, they fence it off. Buy some fancies. Not doing a regular day. It's where they did the chariot races. Circus Maximus. Circus the Maximus. Circus of the this work would be. Oh, you can hear them. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, they're singing now here. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, they're down here. <laughs> yeah, it's the same group of before. That's great. I'm not pretty. So I'm not sure where they are following us. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's good luck. <laughs> The Campio de Fiori, which is the marketplace. Hi! 
So what do you think of the Coliseum? It's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Do you think you would have wanted to be a gladiator? Oh, yeah. No. Brian's like, yeah, yeah I want the power and the fame. Well. I don't know. I would yeah. not. Yeah. No. It's dangerous. Yeah. Because they could kill you anytime. Yeah. It was cool. And you had to, like, fight animals sometimes. Yeah. What about you, Mason? You think you would have wanted to be a gladiator? Yeah. Yeah. Brayden and Mason representing the family. Yeah. I'm crazy. I like to stab some tigers. <laughs> Getting dangerous with it. What was your What was your favorite part? You wouldn't want to be a gladiator. Coliseum. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy being actually being there and seeing it. Yeah. It was crazy. And just like the age of it, it's two thousand years. Like a lot of the area is 2,000 years. And walking on the street, the Caesar walked on, yeah. that was cool. Yeah, Thank you, Larry. very cool. Thank you. Thank you. We got some soupli. Yeah. You like the soupli? Yeah, pretty good. A cheese and rice. And it's fried. Mm -hmm. Very good. Got the burrata and prosciutto and some milky and margarita. <laughs> yeah, tomatoes are from the U.S. They're not even native to Italy. So before they imported tomatoes from us, they used just like olive oil and cheeses. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because I think we... That's yours. Okay. Swiss sugar. You see all the shades are occupied. <laughs> the shades. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah. Everybody this runs the to the shades. This is the courtyard of the pine cone. Because of the gigantic pine cone that you saw at the beginning over there. Oh, yeah. That's a 2,000 years old pine cone, guys. Do you see that? That's very, very old. It's the oldest pine And you know where they found that pine cone close to the Pantheon that you saw this morning? Oh, wow. Over there. It was found, found during some excavations. And then in 1608, it was put there to decor the niche. You see also the stairs? That's yeah. cool. Oh, it turns. Oh, they're turning it. Somebody pushes. Yeah. That is weird. That is cool.
lady. She died very young, so she was accompanied in the eternal sleep with her doll. Wow. She had a golden uh, dress. She still has some pieces over there. Yeah. The, the condition is incredible.
best sandwiches, voted in Rome. El Antico de Neo. I know I just messed that up, but in Paris, they're getting close. They're the sandwiches. The boys are gonna taste them too. And Brad's back at the hotel because he fell asleep. And we're gonna go try to see the Trevi Fountain at night and get some gelato. Yes, but uh, I finished the fresh tomato. Italiano, due in maglie di fresco, mi adoro, e la pasta, la da comune e la da rosso. Great. Lana got ham and cheese. All that. They ran out of tomatoes today. Yeah. How is it? Hammy and cheesy. You can try me and dad's too if you want a little bit more. We got La Boss and La Paradiso. This one has por porchetta. No, it wasn't porchetta. Prosciutto. I forget now. Anyways, they look delicious. They also have a ham and cheese. First bite, how is it? A lot of bread, I see. A nice spready bite. Oh, you can get all that meat. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. I have water. How's the water? Uh, you tried it, I have not, and I think you like it. Thumbs up. Dad's trying it. Oh my god, I'm so excited. <laughs> Very good. It's worth a stop when you're in Rome. It's worth a stop. Alright, we got some gelato and gelati. So good, you guys. Mm. So good. Do you like it, Goobies? I have not tried it yet. I've tried all the You gotta take a bite. Help. You just lick it. Okay. It works way easier. Oh yeah, you definitely get some mango. Do you? Yeah. Is it good? I've yeah. never had mango gelato. That whipped cream is good. What's your favorite flavor, Louie? What? What's your favorite flavor? Strawberry. What's yours, Mace? Mango. He didn't get mango, he got... Coca, Coca, Caramel. Coffee. Which one's your favorite? Uh, coffee. Coffee? Mmm. I love like coffee Finally. coffee. I got tiramisu. Tiny spoon. Mine's dripping everywhere. Uh, I got my spoon out. I got your little spoon. Yeah. Sup. Sup. Gavin just finished his delicious gelato. Oh, he liked chocolates better. Yeah, because the mango one was like really sweet. It was too mangoey. Yeah, but it's pretty good downstairs. We're heading over to Trevi Fountain to see it at night. Hoping it gets dark. The lights just turned on. I feel like we should take something back to. Yeah. Should we take something back to Brayden? Sure. <laughs> We're gonna be like, yeah. we got <laughs> Yeah. So, uh, can we be back to I'm definitely. I'm gonna get a drink. You don't want to try something from here? All right. All right. You try their Big Mac and see if it tastes the same. Yeah. Does Brayden like Big Macs? Yeah. So he, this he eats by all the time. Okay. We'll just do too small. He like tries to steal. Oh, do you want some fancy fries? Do you want cheddar fries? 
Do you want Fanta? No. That Fanta's not like it. Huh? I'm gonna get a drink. Are you getting a drink? You guys do have carry it. That's fine. You guys get a Oh, small. Yeah, we'll just get Brayden the hamburger. You get a burger with it. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna do. Ooh, what's with the zeros? I don't know what the zero. Is this all? Gross. I'm gonna do a Fanta. I'm gonna do a large. Get the goods. Okay. Yeah, do they have, they don't have bottled water, do they? Is that a beer? Yeah. Like a real beer or like a alcohol free beer? That's awesome. Well, it looks like they I just want to see what else they have. They have so much ice cream. They have all kinds of McFlurries. It's just big McFlurries. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Okay. They have all kinds of stuff. Okay. Yeah. Thanks for watching Susie and the Quad Squad. Like, share, and subscribe.